ladies and gentlemen welcome to the weekly review another week goes by and we still don't have news about uh, 10.2.6 which is obviously not coming this week so uh if things go right probably next week i don't know what to make out of it because uh, i'm kind of on the camp that no news is actually not good no ptr is not good because there's no hype or there's nothing to expect right and if it turns out it's a bad patch then yeah i, I just hope i'm wrong about this uh, but uh, I guess we'll wait uh, a week more and we'll see. And uh, luckily, the week that just passed is over because uh, it's incorporeal. Obviously, the worst affix, uh, especially combined with spiteful. Not that you couldn't push keys on this week's, but, you know, um, there's, there's much better weeks. Um, so uh, coming up next week is actually Fortified, Afflicted and Raging. Uh, not the best combination either, but it's not something that is going to slow your dungeons a lot. You just have to be very careful on packs where you used to interrupt the mobs via stuns, CCs, etc. When they drop low below um, 30%, you will not be able to do that anymore. Uh, so just keep that in mind. Some pools might need to be adjusted a little bit in some of the dungeons. And of course, make sure you pick your corresponding spell that allows you to dispel. Of course, if you have one. Uh, the regular <laughs> magic dispels do not work, so you need to have something like a poison disease curse dispel, or if you're a shaman, definitely pick up the poison cleansing totem because it can get rid of both afflicted uh, as the spawn, and of course, be careful during trash packs because your tanks can perish very quickly. Um, unfortunately, I'm taking some time off at the end of this week, so I won't be able to play a lot this affixes but uh, i'll try to to put in some keys and and see how that goes all right and uh that's it pretty much for for the intro and now uh i'll just open some boats and actually on the shaman there's something that i need badly and this is going to be the smolder and trinket this is going to be huge dps increase for me if i don't get it <laughs> sorry if i don't get it i'm not gonna feel sorry because um that trinket can also kill you uh, but I don't think there's anything else that's going to be huge for me. All right. Uh, I don't see the trinket. We get feet, uh, which they're crit haste. They don't have mastery, but I'll see if I can actually hold on. They're not mythic path. I'm, I'm just don't, don't pay attention to me. Don't pay attention to me. Shoulders with avoidance, but they're on the hero path. So let's see if we can snatch something here. Speed reached with speed, but this is my embellishment, so not interested. Uh, back, this is actually something I actually might have mythic level back, um, but obviously I'm using this crafted one because it has the food buff. So yeah. Oh, okay. So this is actually interesting. So rending claw. Um, that could definitely be an upgrade. So it's definitely going to be an upgrade for my. 489 weapon i don't know if it's better than the tongue uh tongue collar but i will sim this uh but i'm pretty sure i'm picking this up i'm pretty sure i'm picking this up um also the tongue collar has sophic devotion which is i guess ideally not perfect um uh, i guess i want uh wafting devotion so this is actually probably going to be an upgrade uh, could be a better upgrade over the town color, but um, if not, it's definitely upgrade upon the axe. So I'm I'm actually gonna pick this up. Uh, that's that's guaranteed, and I'll just see which of the two weapons I'm going to replace. Uh, let me just check this one more time. So this one is Creed Haste. Yeah, so we we'll, we'll definitely we we'll definitely want the mastery. <laughs> I would probably do better to sim it, but um, I don't think any of these is actually going to be better whatsoever. So uh, yeah, this is it. Um, I will make sure not to forget. Uh, where did it go? Okay, I'll, I'll find it later. I'll find it later. But you can also pick a quest uh, from Vodraken that is going to uh, let you do world quests and reward you with some rep if you're interested in that and there's nothing else to do in game. Um, I think I managed to do one key, just one key on every other ult that I have. Uh, let's start with um, Morganis, the server, the, the ult on Morganis. So uh, hopefully I park them in front of the vault as well, but I'm not having high expectations here because uh, one swat is obviously 
uh, not going to be something huge. I might have done raid on the Paladin. I don't remember if it's this week or last week. Um, so that might be something to look forward to there as well uh, for some extra slots, but everything else is just one key, just so I have something involved. And uh, I assume the video is going to be quite boring from here on because I don't expect to get anything exciting. It is what it is though. Um, so starting with the monk, if the game ever loads. Uh, let's make sure we are in Mist River. Uh, I don't know if the monk actually needs anything. It's uh, almost 485. I guess new ring. New ring is going to be huge. And we get shoulders. Okay, I'm going to pick this up because they have leech. But my original shoulders have leech. And I can use the catalyst and get uh, six level item level upgrades. So I guess it's better than nothing. I'm not losing tertiaries. Uh, so that's that's good to know. That's actually very good to know. It's not a wasted vote. All right, now to the scrub ult, uh, which is going to be my evoker. I don't think I did a key on the evoker last week, but I definitely did one this week. I'm not sure I healed. I think I played augmentation because healing on evoker is kind of cringe right now in pugs. Uh, and this is actually one of the classes that I'm expecting for them to change a little bit going into Season 4. Or along with uh, Holy Pally, but we'll wait and see uh, how things turn out to be. Um, opening is preservation, because why not? And we can get an upgrade on this. We can get better rings. And we get gloves. Which is actually... Wait, what? I have champion level level gloves this cannot be right boys i am trolling probably oh i'm not <sighs> look at that all right so that's actually a huge upgrade from champion level which is three out of eight up to 483 all right all right so i guess this is my lucky week all right uh i don't know where these went but i'll just do that right now and I'll figure out if I want to transmog them later, but uh, that was that was actually good. That was actually very good. 481 now. As I said, those are scrub outs, so uh, their item level is not very high, and that's actually good because that means that even one item from the vault could be an upgrade. Uh, so far, I haven't taken tokens on any of them, which would be devastating because it's just two tokens. So. I guess not a bad week. All right, the druid, the druid is actually doing relatively well, I think. I kind of wanted to play it a little bit more, but um, obviously no time right now preparing for my trial, which by the way starts tomorrow. So uh, wish me luck if you're still uh, watching this. And uh, I mean, there's many things here: boots. We need neck badly. We get offhand. We already have a staff. That staff is hero level. I don't know if this is actually... Let's see what else we have. This is champion hero something something. Yeah, even if I pick this up, I don't think I'm going to use it. I probably have two tokens somewhere. So if I get two more tokens next week, it's going to be a uh, socket somewhere. So better this than nothing. All right, I'm going to check the priest next and I'm going to leave the paladin for dessert because, uh, as I said, I think I did raid on it um, and uh, the, the Lego didn't drop for me. But I guess if I do raid a few more times, I might actually get it. Not sure that I want to do this because as far as I know, it's still extremely expensive to actually craft the Lego. So I'm definitely not looking forward to that, especially if I don't play Retribution that much, which is basically not the case um although i did play mostly retribution this season a little bit of prot and even less holy uh as for the priest priest is almost at 482 i think i can upgrade that so that's not so bad we can use a better bag and those are mid-level we actually need crests bracers bracers is the biggest thing we need crests just to upgrade uh, our gear 
Uh, we get hands. We can pick this up because uh, obviously we can use the catalyst and uh, potentially upgrade them. So I'll do that. Um, six item levels, potentially. It's six item levels, but uh, as I said, I just need to play this character. Uh, otherwise, there's no way to, to upgrade it. Um, I'll find those later. And now the Pali. I'm not sure what spec to open the Pali, uh, the vote is Pali, because uh, I don't play Holy. I haven't played Holy lately. It just doesn't feel right to play Holy in keys. Um, actually, the raid that I did, um, it was with my guild. They had like an old run. They just needed warm bodies. I actually played as Retribution um, without knowing what to do, you know? So uh, even there, I didn't heal. Not that I would probably enjoy healing as Pali in raid, but that's a different topic. Um, so let's see. We are red right now. We're actually 486. The Pali is doing great this season. It was lucky getting gear and everything. Um, so I'm not sure. I will probably open as protection because I have okay trinkets. I'm happy with these trinkets. Uh, I have 489 weapon, right? So I'll just open as protection just for the sake of it. Maybe I get a good trinket or something. Um, let's see. Oh, actually, the rate was last week, obviously. Uh, and this is going to be token because those don't have tertiaries. We already have them. They're upgraded. And I don't think I have any other tokens on the poly. So that's actually quite sad. But this is actually one of my geared characters. So uh, apparently uh, there's no chance I get something good from the vault, right? All right. So uh, if you're still here, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, probably not much content coming up this week. As I said, I'm going to be on trial tomorrow, uh, which I'm not going to stream. I'll just try to focus and do well. And whatever happens, then I'm off at the end of the week. I'll try to put up some content and maybe stream in one of the days. But if not, I'll just see you next week. And uh, hopefully we have a new patch then to entertain ourselves. So good luck. Enjoy your time until then. I'll see you later. Bye bye. Take care and get out of here.